What's going on beautiful people? Welcome to We Teach AI Designs. In this video, I'm going to show you how we created this inside Mid Journey. Let's get right into it. Okay, first thing we want to do is go ahead and sign into Mid Journey. We are currently on our home page. I always like to start right here in the community feed just to kind of get inspiration to see, you know, what other creators are designing, see if there's any elements that I want to uh, modify. We can always uh, tab it over from new to top top stuff this is some of the new designs that people are creating super dope stuff all right dope so let's say i wanted to go ahead and modify this right here uh let's go ahead and click it this is the image it's like a sketch slash uh you know just really just dope abstract uh image um so let's go ahead and hit copy here i'm gonna copy i'm gonna copy full command even though it's a square image, we're going to go ahead and copy the full command and we are going to head over to our discord. Now, if you have an online memo pad or a notepad on your uh, desktop or sticky notes, it might be good to go ahead and use those uh, tools as well. But we're going to go ahead, click imagine, gonna hit paste. And instead of an elderly bald African man, we're going to say we're going to say we want to do a elderly african woman with a stretch neck and a huge jade earrings who hunts with the magical machine gun as imagined by alejandro not sure what that name is we're gonna let that go we're gonna delete that all right perfect so we're gonna go right with we're gonna go we're gonna go with that huge i'm gonna say huge red jade earrings um, and we're going to go ahead and click enter and see, see what, see what comes up. Um, I want you guys to understand that sometimes when we create prompts and we create, uh, different things that we want the mid journey, uh, uh, bot or uh, mid journey um, application to 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 do. Sometimes it doesn't look great the first time around. You know, you can always use your variations to v1, v2, v3, v4 to make uh, new versions of it, or you can uh, reroll the whole thing by hitting the uh, blue button right here on the side here. Uh, so just to let you guys know that, you know, don't give up on your first prompt. You might want to make some modifications and changes no matter what, but let's go ahead and see what, you know, that it gives us here. Okay. Dope. So mid journey is complete. So let's go ahead and click it. All right. Dope. Um, this is really dope, man. Really fresh. Uh, and just to kind of let you guys, uh, see what the original prompt was here. This was the original prompt here. And, um, I copied the prompt copied it verbatim um and i made some modifications i made it um a uh, uh, elderly uh, woman instead of a, a elderly man and um it still gave me something that was completely different than what you know we see here a lot of times in the ai art community you see uh, people a lot of people complaining about oh you're taking my prompts or or it's just like my artist stuff like that but you can use the same prompts and you could create something entirely different entirely new so um you got uh image one image two really like that three four i think i'm liking the one and four so i think i'm gonna go ahead and upscale one and four we're going to wait to mid journey goes ahead and and uh processes that and what that is going to do is going to um upscale it for us so that way we have a larger and large image and then from there i'm going to take it one step further and enlarge it even more okay dope so we are done and we are process so we're gonna take a look at this think this is super dope the you know the, the little whatever it is going on is throwing me off just a little bit so i think i'm gonna I'm rock with this one right here i'm gonna go rock with this little this image is kind of like she's in the desert and it's like it's you know but it's still dystopian usually dystopian images are very dark and dreary this is bright um and still kind of in a futuristic afrofuturistic vibe so we're gonna go with that we're gonna click open original just to enlarge it just uh, even much more. But I noticed where it's not as detailed, it's very kind of soft. So we wanna go ahead and upscale it even more. Let's go ahead, right click, and we are gonna save this image. We're gonna save this right inside the downloads. And what I like to use I, is, I use I like to use let's enhance.io for my images. Uh, the reason why I like to do it is because um, 
you know you can upload multiple images at once uh you can clearly see what the input is and what the output is and um, by no means if you have lightroom if you have photoshop and you want to just use the upscaler there you absolutely can um this right here uh just allows me to be able to do it with one click and this is kind of what i like to use so as you see the input is 1024 by 1024 1.5 megapixels output is 2048 2048 4.2 megapixels 300 dpi that is the standard for print uh, on the right hand side you got the tone enhancer color enhancer i'm gonna just rock with the color enhancer and that right there is going to allow us to be able to uh, put this on the T-shirt if we want to, a mug, cell phone case, um, all those different things. You know, I might uh, scale up just a little bit more using Canva just to make sure that all, all the dimensions are correct and everything kind of fits to, to size. And from here, we could go ahead and click download. We're going to go into our actual downloads here. We're going to compare the two. So this is after, this is before, after, before. So I'm pretty sure you can see like the the, the colors are a little bit um, are a little bit more popped up. The uh, clarity is that much more rich. Um, I really looks like I ain't done unless I did that. I really like the uh, the uh, output. Um, it is an extra cost to use uh, letsenhance.io, but again, you can also use any tool that you have at your disposal. All right, dope. So that was our tutorial on how to create this inside Mid Journey. So make sure that you guys subscribe, like, comment, and whatever video you want me to create next, just you know, leave me a comment below. And uh, this channel is for you to learn, grow with AI art in Mid Journey. So uh, let's make it happen. Let's let's grow together, y'all. Peace.